On a beautiful spring afternoon, the little artist goat was painting a landscape on her canvas. The little artist goat loved painting. Whenever she painted, she focused on her task. It was so much fun for her that time flew by. I'm not saying this because I painted it, but this painting came out really good. It's such a good painting, but how? As always, the wolf was jealous of the little goat's talent. Artist! Yeah, right! You couldn't even draw my tail! The bad wolf was confident that he could do a better job. Everyone will see who's the best painter in town. That conceited goat will be embarrassed to call herself an artist. <laughs> That's such a funny painting, Wolf. What exactly did you paint? Isn't it obvious? It's a self-portrait. Doesn't it look like me? Don't I look handsome? <laughs> but this looks more like a monkey. <laughs> the little artist goat isn't here. I'll put my plan into work. <laughs> Since your painting is not quite beautiful, let me add a little touch here and there and make it more beautiful. <laughs> what is this white smudge? Oh no, my painting is ruined. The bear and elephant are coming. When they see your painting, they'll know who's the best artist. Welcome, guys. Let me explain my painting. Whoa, it's fantastic. The snowflakes on the flowers are beautiful. <gasps> Amazing! You can express so much emotion in a painting. Ooh. I'm so happy to hear that you liked my painting so much. What? I painted those snowflakes. Those ignorant animals don't understand anything about art. Eventually, the Wicked Wolf's plan failed once again. Hey guys! Subscribe to our channel Kondo-san and watch the most popular fairy tales, cartoons, and nursery rhymes. Don't forget to click the bell for notifications. <laughs>